Hello. Happy Halloween. -een. It's Johnny. And tonight, we're going to be playing some sinister games. Now, um, some tech stuff up top. I haven't. I'm playing this on my uh, laptop, and mic is a bit quiet. Okay, so periodically, uh, the game will sort of freeze like this. Uh, that's when I'm in OBS because uh, this is a game that doesn't continue doing stuff. It seems when I'm not actually on the window. So we're going to be um, going to be going a little bit fast and loose with the tech here because, uh, interestingly, I am actually right now in the old house because um, we still have it for another couple of weeks, and I was I've had to come down for, well, for MCM Comic Con, but also doing a bunch of like cleaning and uh, that sort of thing. So I am playing this uh, in a quite an empty. Quite an, uh, quite an empty space, which is feels appropriate. If you hear any uh, banging around, uh, that's uh, just a ghost. Um, which By which I mean it's Steve, um, who is a ghost uh, because I murdered him. Halloween! Uh, right, so. I have been requested to turn up, turn up the um, audio a little bit. I think I can probably do that. Um, okay, I think that should be a little bit, a little bit higher. Uh, Jester or Maddie, can you let me know? Uh, can you, can people hear the ominous music, uh, the ominous iron lung music um, coming through the stream right now? Wonderful. In which case. Up top, before we dive into this uh, moon river of blood, moon lake of blood, well, we'll see. Uh, I'm going to read a few Kofis. Kofi from Gustav. Hope you can get some rest soon. Take care. So do I. We'll see. Uh, Kofi from Akuma. Hi, Johnny and Co. It appears that a whole lot of exciting things are coming to a head right now for you all, and I'm incredibly excited for you. I've already snagged my copy of Family Business, and I'm excited for it to get here. Second Kofi coming shortly. I'm running out of cat... Richters. To celebrate all this good fortune, please make sure to treat yourself. We love and appreciate you. One more thing. I need two dates for a project I'm working on. One mid to late November, and another one in January to February. Care to provide? Can't wait to watch the VOD back later. I... Do you just mean, like... Pick a day. I, I don't know what this is for, obviously. Uh, November the 23rd and 2nd of February. Hope that's hope that's what you were after. Um, props not Hawkeye. Howdy, howdy. Date this past weekend led to a second date yesterday in which I ran her through some pit crawler. Not sure if I want to see her again, but at least I've gotten another person into pit crawler. Dates are temporary, but pit crawler is eternal. Well, I hope that uh, your pit crawler experience with her didn't uh, uh, didn't lead, uh, didn't contribute to the to the uncertainty about uh, a third date. But uh... <laughs> right, let's dive into Iron Lung. I know I, I I've not played this before i've not watched a playthrough i know a little bit about it conceptually but uh, i'm very excited to get some just real sinister vibes decades ago every known star and habitable planet vanished leaving only those who were on space stations or starships this event became known as the quiet rapture with supplies dwindling and infrastructure crumbling Survivors are searching for any trace of natural resources in a universe of barren moons, lit by the ghost light of vanished stars. One such moon holds a strange anomaly, a strange anomaly, an ocean of blood. You are a convict, tasked with exploring this anomaly. Why can't I say this word? Tasked with exploring this anomaly, in a makeshift submarine nicknamed the Iron Lung. It was not designed for this depth. 
so you will be welded inside, and the forward window will be closed. There was no time for training. If successful, you earn your freedom. Do I... Oh, it's having a think. Beginning at descent. Cruising depth in roughly 40 seconds. Stand by. Um, I'm seeing some voltage irregularities in the instruments, so keep an eye out for sparks or flames or anything like that. No oh, good sparks or flames. Am I meant to be able to look around? I can't currently. But... Approaching maximum depth. Uh, the hole's feeling it, but it's still holding strong. Closing porthole shielding. We're starting to lose rate of signal. You'll be at cruise depth soon, so risk thing and be careful. You're on your own. Oh, okay. Here's the map. I don't know where I am, though. Be briefing, is that? Two weeks ago, we conducted an exploration of Moon AT5 for the first time since the Quiet Rapture, leading to the discovery of a fourth blood ocean. A trench beneath the ocean's surface has several points of interest. Your task is to photograph these points of interest with the SM-13's forward camera. Photos must be taken within two units of the specified position and ten degrees of the specified angle. You can also use the camera to help with navigation. Only photos taken at the specified points of interest will be saved. Since you can't navigate by sight, pay attention to your coordinates and consult the map. The proximity indicators next to the subcontrols will trigger if you're getting close to an obstacle. Good luck. Okay, is there... What are you... Oh, I see. This is the... This is the photo. Right, and that... Those look like some horrible plants, I think? What are you? This is the local database. Be sure to update before each descent. Help. I'm scared. Okay, good. Actually, hang on. X32. Uh, no, I'm not going to bother putting that in. Okay. Alright then. So. Okay, how do I operate this thing? There was no time for training! Oh, whoops. I don't, where actually am I? Oh, hang on, does it say X182, Y116? X182, X182, Y166, Y166. So I'm here, I think. Or 116. So I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm here, and my angle is zero, which I assume to be forward, so how do I go forward? Oh, do I just, so I probably, um, uh, I can go up to about 200. Should be about here. Then I can turn 
Ooh. Careful of that momentum. Oh, no, back. Okay. Perfect. wonder what's... Uh, going to have a look. Okay, just more plants, I think. Okay. So I'm thinking about here. Uh, if I stay at about 200, I can head over to about 270 on the x-axis. This is uh, this is quite tense. Oh, what? What? What is that? That that's probably the canyon wall. Right? That's, uh... Yeah, it has, hasn't moved. That's just... I'm just quite... I'm just too close to the canyon wall. That's... that's oh, I must be, like, right... Yeah, because I'll be... I'm crossing right near the canyon wall. Okay. Okay. We're all right. We're all right. Wait. Oops. I messed up. Let's try that again. Yes, yes, yes. The quiet rapture. Really thought. <clears throat> really thought that was... Uh... Okay. Kofi from Kiera Samuel. Got my second signed copy of Family Business the other day. Around halfway through it so far, and I'm absolutely loving it. Thanks very much. Looking forward to getting into this stream too. Kofi from the Monster Mash. Hello, hello. Happy Halloween to everyone. My good news is that my copy of, Cap my copy of Family Business finally came. I picked it up on the way to the office yesterday and spent the morning showing it off to my co-workers like a kid on show and tell day. That's really lovely. Thank you for telling me. Approaching maximum depth. Uh, the hole's stealing it, but it's still holding strong. Yes, yes, yes. Down we go. Closing port hole shielding. Hmm. We're starting to lose radio signal. You'll be at cruise depth soon, so risk thing and be careful. You're on your own. Oh, yeah, sorry about the laptop fan sound. I'm having to use the camera mounted. I'm having to mount the camera actually on the top of my laptop, so... Sorry. Okay, let's try going... Let's try going to... Let's try going to 210, shall we? Too close to the this one now. Where am I? Two eleven. I should be clear on that side. Yeah, just some plants in the canyon wall. Okay, well. Okay. 
serious? Just relax, mate. Probably want to be closer to 300. Oh my god. Really? Too high that way. Okay, three hundred two oh seven. So I'm here, about here. So if I aim down this way, what's the? How close did I have to be? Did it say two two units? Two units. Oh, 322, 186, of course. It actually does tell me. 322. 322, 186. Oh, let's get up to 322. In fact, I can turn a little bit that way. So I'm Don't like that noise. I think I've overshot. Still not, still not great at this whole navigation business. Three twenty two one eight six, perfect, and the angle was thirty three, I believe. Oh, way overshot that. Okay, well, let's see. So let's see. Let's see what the deal is, shall we? Kind of worms? Teeth, maybe? Hmm. 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 Okay. Well, let's take a trip straight up, shall we? We go up to about two fifty, we should be good. The noises in this game, uh, something else. Oh, probably best, probably best turn. Seventy-eight. So if I turn around here, three 
Another photo, see if it, they've moved at all, see if they're moving or that. No, they're completely static. Wreckage, maybe? Like a, almost like a rib cage. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Uh, Kofi from Ori Finn. Happy spoopy season all, celebrating that my baby boy, Big Ginger Fluffy Tabby, is home from emergency vet surgery and doing well, and that the vets could open a claim with the pet insurance company directly rather than me having to claim it back. That's Those are both really relieving things. Good work. Uh, and I hope he gets better soon. Uh, Kofi from Ashley. Happy Friday, all. Have some money for the blood gods of the blood ocean. Hope you die in a horribly interesting way. Cheers! Uh, Kofi from Hopefully Welsh. Uh, hiya, my good news is I bought a bunch of terrible horror movies to watch with my dog on Halloween. Also, I finished Family Business, and it is very, very good. Well, thank you, and enjoy your terrible horror movies. Kofi from Shiny Happy Goth. Happy Halloween! For my stories for trick-or-treaters, Count Magnus and A Warning to the Curious are too long. It needs to fit on one page. Yeah, those are long. But I was just able to fit a school story. That's one of my favourites. I also have a couple of Yeats poems and a fairy tale and Jabberwocky for the wee ones. Ah, oh, I love a bit of, love a bit of uh, Jabberwocky. Kofi from Kiera Samuel got my cat back from the vet today. What? Two cat, two cat situations in a single day. Goodness. Um, she had a plate put in her leg after getting an infection, but all went well and hopefully she'll have a somewhat speedy recovery. We're tuning into this stream and I'm trying to ignore her glares. Don't think she's happy about the cone. Oh no, free her! I mean, don't free her, because she will just, you know, chew her way through uh, uh, through anything. But uh, chat is convinced the photos are of fries. Yep, okay, yeah, no, yeah, no, I can see it, I can see it. Just deep, deep ocean fries. So, okay. Oh, now time to navigate this little channel. That's going to be fun. Uh, so here, let's try and get to this point, which is 300... Because, uh, I feel like I heard something. It wasn't, and it wasn't something I'm keen on being in an ocean of blood with. If I'm going to be quite frank. Oh, okay. That's probably here. So I'll just, I think it's time to navigate by proximity alarm now. It's... Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, okay. No, no, that's fine. That's fine. Everything's alright. Everything's chill. Everything's chill. X 307. 
Yes, okay. Okay, so we're about here. So we should be wanting to try... Yeah, we're just, we're just going to navigate by proximity alarm right now, chat. Oxygen notification. What? Oh, my oxygen shit! Oh no, I really hope that's on like a set narrative timer and not, you know, and not actually timing my progress because uh, I've been going way too slow. I've been stopping to read Kofi's. So where am I headed? I'm headed 406, 250. Okay, so I think I should be just going to keep on going until I hear a proximity alarm. Fifty-nine, four hundred and six. Okay, so um, what is that? Two hundred fifty-nine. Okay, we're almost there. Okay, that'll that'll do it. And what's the angle? 296. Okay, we're almost. Okay. Come on. The perfect is not the enemy. Don't let the perfect be the enemy of the good, Johnny. Just take that photo and see what. Okay, no, that's worms. Uh, no, or vertebrae of some sort? That's. Oh, don't know. Don't know. Don't like it. But that's that's fine. Not being paid to like it, not being paid at all. Okay. Now, time to backtrack, I think. It's time for what we in the Blood Submarine, the Blood Marine trade, call vibes based navigation. Okay, yeah, we're we're back around here, so now I think we can start to angle up and head through that little that little gullet there. I'm looking for so five oh six. So once on. Once I'm past the 450 mark, I should be in the clear, big blood ocean. Oh. Mind yourself. Ah. Feels like a bit of a cheap little jump scare, to be honest, but uh, I'll accept it. Okay, so we're in the clear. So where are we headed? 277, 560. Okay. Is, that, is this something I can fix? Because this hiss is... Oh. No. No, I cannot fix it. It is simply broken. Wonderful.
what the, what what there is nothing nearby chat there's nothing nearby my submarine should not be any proximity alarms should not be any proximity alarms. Sixty angle forty three, okay. No idea what that is. Yeah, impossible to make out. Still, that's fine. Six, okay, six thirteen, one nine seven, one nine seven, six thirteen, one nine seven. Oh no! There, okay, so there is, there is no pause. There is no pause to. Uh, I may just have to push through and do a huge, a huge number of kofis, uh, a hopefully huge number of kofis after. Oh wait, actually, hang on. I can sort of pause the game by just flicking to a different window. Yeah, wonderful. That works. Okay, sorry, um, I'm going to take a short break to read some Kofi's. A chat is convinced the photos are of fries. Uh, oh, curly fries. Looks like a fun new pasta shape. Uh, fin the tweet. It's a stomach grumbling for the fries. Hmm. Kofi um, from B. I just wanted to share how excited I am for all your content, especially family business, which I pre-ordered, and TMA too. Thank you, Johnny, and all that you you work with. I love your work. Oh, thank you. That's really lovely of you to say. Code uh, from Tomcat. Hi, Johnny. Good to see you after two weeks of not seeing you. Good news I have is that we're relaxing. We're having a relaxing Friday, and Lulu the dog is chewing on a deliciously smelly piece of snack. Oh, wonderful. I'm sure she's having a lovely, smelly time. Uh, Kofi from Tracy, happy early Halloween. My bit of good news is that I'm happily reading Ray Bradbury's Something Wicked This Way Comes for the first time, though I cannot help thinking of TMA whenever the Calliope organ is mentioned. Yeah, it's in there. Uh, Kofi from Ryu, oh, that is a good story. I hope you really enjoy it. Kofi from Ryu here, finally able to watch the Friday streams again because Rings of Power is over. I loved it. My brother and I started referring to Elrond as Twink Elrond as a joke. Which led to my dad looking up what it meant. Um, did you? Uh, yeah, Sasha was watching it and seemed to enjoy. I think enjoyed, like really enjoyed some of it. Quite enjoyed most of it. Um, and uh, apparently, the Sauron reveal, like the Sauron reveal, feels like it. It maybe came a little bit too early. Like I don't know. Maybe hang on to that for another season. But we'll see. Um, Go from Lacey. Hey Johnny, my good news is I finally surpassed the fun number, 69, for total number of porcelain clowns sitting in my closet. It's your fault, by the way. No, it isn't. Don't put that on me. I didn't make you, I didn't make you buy 69 porcelain clowns. Uh, can't wait to watch you keep playing. Well, I, I yeah, I, I can't wait to keep playing instead of contemplating someone who owns 69 porcelain clowns. Godspeed to you. But that's not on me. Uh, chat has decided this is not a submarine. It's a sub-sanguine. I like that. Uh, Kofi from Kira Samuel. Uh, obligatory extra Kofi, Kofi to keep up your air supply? Question mark. Oh, fingers crossed. Uh, and Kofi from Toesite. Hi Johnny, fantastic timing. My copy of Family Business just arrived during the spooky stream. I'm so excited to break this open over the weekend. The book is very cool to the touch from being outside, which I'm also enjoying. Yes, I think it's a it's a book that deserves to be a bit chilly, I think. And I've completely forgotten what the 613197. Six 
one three. So we're on the right x axis. One nine seven. is 55 okay all right let's find out what's out there north rise oh no that's uh that's a skeleton that's the skeleton of something with teeth that's a something with teeth Wonderful. I guess we've got to go do this one now. Okay. On we go. Just plunging ahead. Uh, we'll die if we go much past 7.50, but up until then we should be fine. It's a nice, big, open cavern. Nice, big, open cavern. Nothing to worry about. Nothing whatsoever to concern ourselves with. Okay, let's see, we're at 700. 700 and 261. Okay, we're maybe a little bit high. We can probably probably adjust ourselves a bit down. Yep, it's them uh, stomach rumblies for the fries again. That's what you said it was, wasn't it, chat? Okay, 7.50. And... 2.6. 2.59. Okay, so we should... Oh, we're going to need to be so careful. Going to need to be so careful, chat. What's the... So this avenue is at about 775 and... 775 and like 260. Oh. Okay. Okay. Nope. Nope, the other... Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, chat, we made it. We made it, chat. So I want to get to about 8.50. And then... Then do a turnaround. Eight six four two five eight. That's a weird noise. Two five eight. Oh 
no that's wrong I'm going to get a little bit closer ok ok yeah and angle 209 Statues or something over it. Well, no time to really think much more about it. I've got to get out of this real nasty little. Oh no, I'm going to have to navigate to that fucker, aren't I? Okay, that's all right. That's all right. We're good. Let's just cruise for a little while. So we're here. Well, we're about. We're about here. Let's. Okay, we're now going back, back on the horrible bit. Shit, 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 shit. Where are we? Seven, eight, five. Seven, eight, five. And two, seven, two. Oh, yeah, we have gone. Yeah, okay, yep, yeah, we are. We're in the neck. We're in the throat. Gonna have to weave through these fuckers. Sweat a little bit. Ugh. Fucking, fucking jump scares. Okay. Uh, it's about the five fifty line. Just. Yeah, it's about the 570 line we want to be going up at, so... We can cruise for a while! Through a nice... Oh! Fuck was that? Someone banged. Someone banged my su fucking submarine. There was no proximity alarm. One would expect a proximity alarm. Right. Okay. I should be able to, should be able to just sail up all the way to the 500 mark. But let's find out. Shouldn't hit us. We should be able to pass it. Yeah, 
no problem. We're laughing, chat. Everything's coming up, Johnny. What the? What the? Oh. Well, there's not enough time to turn and have a look. No, just some, some of them fucking what I assume are plants. And I really hope our plants. Four, seven, eight. Okay, so we want six, two, three, five, twenty. Six, two, three, five, twenty. Okay, I think if we go up this way, we should be all right. Oh, 520, perfect. Oh, check out that sub, sub skills. That's what they call me. Oh, no, not quite. You know what? I'm going to, this time, this time I'm going to be perfect. They're not just going to give me their freedom. They're going to be impressed. Oops. 520. 63 and angle 63. Yes! Oh! Back of the net. Oh, yeah, that's some sort of. Ask more bones. It's more of them. More of them bones. Wonderful. Perfect. You love to see it. Maybe a little bit, a little bit less than that, and then we just cruise for a while. Don't hope nothing. Oh, whoops, I keep hitting. So we want to get to a bow. Oh, good. There's distortion here, that'll help. Uh, still, we want to get to about 370, I reckon. And while we're cruising, squirrel with a nut allergy. I just got offered the job I wanted despite interviews with the train making issues with the train making me late to the inter interview. Fortun fortunately, I had arranged to be an hour early, so I only arrived 10 minutes late. Have a coffee on me to celebrate. I'll be enjoying my copy of Family Business this Halloween. That's wonderful and congratulations. Oh. Is it? Where are we at? 5, 7, 16. Yeah, we're probably a little bit too high. Uh, and yeah, that's, I, that's good planning. That's some good contingency planning uh, right there. So congratulations that it paid off. Uh, Kofi from Hero. Hey Johnny, my first time donating. Hope you're doing well, man. Excited for all the future plans. Thank you for the spooky stream. Definitely needed right now. Well, thank you. I'm having fun with it. And a Kofi from KO. Happy spoopy ween. Just got... To... Oh! Hang on. Yeah, I think this is this bit. So, we're at, what, we're at what, 4.50? Yeah, 4.50 and... Fun. Yeah. Uh, I just got to the last chapter of 13 stories and I'm very excited to finish it. Looking forward to family business next. Dinner tonight will apparently be some sort of fries thanks to the stream. Maybe a poutine. Yeah, maybe. That's, that's... That's probably all it is. It's just, it's just poutine. Oh dear. just poutine. I feel like I feel like that 
the it feels like the oxygen notification is maybe story tight, so I'm not quite as worried about the time. And Co uh, Kofi from Cochet. Hello, I'm happy to say my signed copy of Family Business arrived this week. I also got I almost got a concussion from falling over my dog Fiddlefoot. What a great dog name! As I raced him for the post because he, of course, must kill everything the postman brings. But I have it, and I'm so excited to start reading. Well, I hope you have. I hope you really enjoy it. Probably this bit. We're at five. Three. We want to be a little bit, a little bit further down. Oh, okay. Or well, maybe not. Time to navigate through this bullshit. Fuck, there's something up ahead. Where am I? Okay, how, where am I? Five, f sixty. Oh, this comes out here. I, okay. Okay. Let's. Okay. At what point will I be free and clear? If I hit... When I hit 650 on the Y, I'm free and clear. Yeah. Threading that needle. Okay, and we're out. Oh, okay, well I can go for this one. Uh, what is that noise? Fuck! There's a fire! Fuck! Fuck! Ow! Fire! Fire! Oh, there's more fire. What, there's a, is there more fire? I just, I just took care of the fire. Go away, shoot. Shoot. Goodness. Oh, what a to-do. Uh, seven... Three, two, three, two, five, seven, four, one. Okay. And what's the angle? 80. Wonderful. Right, what we got now? Probably something a bit weird. Yes, yeah, more bones, like claws, maybe? Is that 
Is that a weird fucked up face? I don't know. Could be a weird fucked up face. Oh no, I don't want to have to do this one. <sighs> Fine, okay. 300 to... Let's... let's now I want to say six fifth six five five to three hundred is where I want to be navigating to. Well, sorry, three hundred to six five five. I believe there was a fire. Oh. Three hundred and six. Seven hundred. Oh yeah, it's this bit. No, I should. I should be alright. I should be clear of it. Yeah. And I was just like, oh, what's that noise? As I gradually burned to death. That'll have used up a fuck ton of my oxygen, won't it? Okay. Oh, time to thread some fucking needles. How much do you believe in me, chat? Um, my proximity alarms are going to start going off uh, in about... Well, very soon. Yep, there it is. There they go. Six five five is maybe too close to here, but I don't like it. Let's see at about two hundred it's gonna start telling me that it's fine. It's fine. We're doing alright. do. We want to get closer. Then we want to go, we want to go down. looking for 180 by 57 180 by 576 okay shit 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 is that it's not more fire no it's just another leak it's just another leak we're all right Okay, okay, alright, alright, alright. I hear what you're putting down here. I hear what you're putting down right now. Everything's shaking in a way that feels like it shouldn't be. Is that an oxygen thing? Yeah, no, that's 576, 180, uh, and 184, yeah, mm-hmm, this is, uh, okay, this is where we're meant to be, but everything's going a bit weird. Okay, I don't know what that is. I don't want to know what that is, but it's, it's weird, and it's messing with everything. So I'm going to go away 
I think, now, because that's, uh, that's what we like to call an anomaly. Fine. We just we just came to a dead stop. But it's fine. We can go again. We can go again. Hang on. I feel like there should be some proximity alerts. Okay, good. There they are. Two eight five. Wait, two eight five. How did I get out here? I didn't navigate out here. Six seven seven. Yeah, I'm out here. I should be here. Okay, that. Hmm. Something happened. Something happened there. Just gonna take a quick coffee break. Oh, somebody bought a coffee. Uh, oh, Endwich Cat Possum. Sounds like an underwater sermon is being said. Ooh, it does rather. Also, underwater sermon. Absolutely my favourite indie band of the early two thousands. Oops, wrong one. Where am I headed? Yeah, I want to be cruising all the way to like 625 here. Kofi from TMLK. Or Timulk. Hi Johnny, my good news is that though my week has been stressful, my game dev studio is very close to publishing a demo of a survival horror game set in 90s Poland. I got to choose the VO cast this week, and I can't help wait to hear the results. That's really cool. I look forward to playing it. Um, oh, uh, yes, uh, Maddie's reminded me to plug my book. Uh, so uh, I've written two books, uh, both horror, uh, the first of which was called 13 Stories. and is Oh, shit. What the f fuck? Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I kind of suspected that moment might have been coming. But... Yep, didn't, did not enjoy it. Did not enjoy it. I'm gonna just... Let's, uh... Let's, let's, let's put that on pause while I finish that. Uh, very important plug for my second book, which has come out about two weeks ago. It's called Family Business. It is, uh... It's about, um... Uh, it's about a death cleaning service... It's horror. Uh, it is all about, you know, what happens. It's about grief. It's about loss. It's about how we clear up, how we forget things. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's um, it's really good. Uh, it should be out now, uh, basically everywhere in the UK. Um, in internationally, I think it's out early next year, but you can already get the audiobook uh, and the uh, ebook. And uh, if you want, if you want to pay the horrendous international shipping, you can just order it from a UK bookseller. Anyway, let's let's just go. Let's just keep going. What? Oh no. Oh, no. There shouldn't be anything here. There should not be anything here, but okay. Okay, let's see what's out there. Weights. I don't know what the fuck that is. Maybe it's a wall? Is it maybe just a wall? Seven, 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 seven. Oh, maybe I'm just... Oh, maybe I do actually... Maybe I've got... Maybe I'm a little bit over-rattled, and actually, I do just need to navigate my submarine better. 
yeah, okay, maybe I just need to navigate my submarine better. Sorry, my sub sanguine. Going through the old, the old canyon. Don't like these. Shit. I'm so close. I'm so close to that last picture. Just keep cruising to 600. Keep cruising to 600. Okay, maybe turn a little bit and that. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. The blood is. There's a breach. There's a breach. 600 so I can just oh, actually maybe I've gone too far okay all right this is uh... okay 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 about 760 I can turn just keep the key is not to panic you know, the key is not to panic, just stay calm. Don't pay attention to the blood that is uh, just getting... Okay, alright, so I'm about here, so I can turn. And at this point is... Okay, it's about 675. Okay, all right. Yeah, it's getting it's getting higher. It is definitely going to cover the console soon, so I really need to. Uh, you need to just keep going. Just keep going. Don't don't let the blood get you down. Hey, at least there's no fires. You know, I'd like to see a fire start now. Six seven five. So it's just it's just up. It's just up. Six seven five eight twenty eight. Eight twenty eight. That's all I need. Okay. Fuck, 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 come on. Eight twenty eight. That's fine, that's fine. And what's the angle? What's the angle? 298. 298. That'll do. Ah! Okay. All right. The expedition ultimately raised more questions than answers. Satellite images showed pieces of the SM-13 scattered all over the bottom of the trench, as though it had been torn apart by some huge beast. The wreckage cannot be reached at this time. No photographs have been recovered. The stars shine pale as bones. The moon is a lifeless corpse, its ocean a gaping wound. The universe, what's left of it, is dying. But somewhere in the void... There must be hope. I really enjoyed that. But... I'll be honest. 
the ending just being a big jump scare. You know what? No, it's a one hour game. It's a one hour game. It's a one hour lead up to a good jump scare. So I'm, I'm, I think I had a good time with that. I had a, I had a very good time with the majority of the game. Uh, and that, uh, and, and that ending jump scare, I'll, I'll forgive it. I'll forgive it. And, uh, let's see, we've got, oh. Is uh, anyone, ha uh, Maddie uh, or Jester, are you having any buffering? The the stream quality indicator is a little bit. Okay, cool. All right. Yes, it is a black screen because I've closed the game. Uh, but what I am going to play now is anatomy oh oh whoops i've done a thing it's fine everyone it's okay okay i've breached containment i've breached containment uh but that's fine i am once again within containment uh i don't know if we're going to um uh, uh, i don't know if we're going to be able to get all the way through it is a short game same as iron lung uh but yeah you know what if oh well okay uh, if it hits 10, uh, Maddie and Jester, let me know if you have a hard out, because uh, I think we should be alright with anatomy, but, uh, but we'll find out, won't we? Oh, is it, is it coming through alright? You hearing a VHS coming in? This is so I am in the house having a look around. Oh, that door is locked. That door is locked. I've got a big empty room. Oh, some weird art on the walls. Oh, plug sockets, that's good. Yep, that looks like some sort of... Well, I mean, I suppose it's called anatomy, so... Uh, wouldn't be... Wouldn't be the anatomy house with... Oh, a TV! I can't... I can't watch TV. Oh, it's a couch! Oh, I can jump! Oh, that's nice. It's nice to be able to jump. Yep, that's a hand. Oh. Yep. That's... Perhaps you can guess why I like this game. psychology of the modern civilized human being, it is difficult to overstate the significance of the house. Since as early as the Neolithic era, humankind has defined itself by its buildings. Buildings for worship, buildings for socializing, buildings for protection, even buildings for the commemoration of the dead. But of all the structures that mankind has invented for itself, there is little doubt that the house is that which it relies on. Oh, wait. Hold on, it's gone weird. Sorry, I'm only just being... Uh, I'm just hearing now that uh, I'm getting... There we are. Sorry about that. Um, most completely for its continued survival. There is a tape in the dining room. Was I... Am I not in the dining room? No, I'm in the kitchen. So, 
houses, eh? What's their deal? The house is one of the key elements that separates modern humanity from its more primitive antecedents. No other creature goes to such lengths to create lasting, permanent shelter for itself, nor regards such shelters with such reverence and import. Why do human beings of our modern age foster this tremendous sympathy toward their homes? There are many reasons, of course, but perhaps it is due in some small part to seeing them as a reflection of ourselves. The downstairs bathroom. Where's the downstairs bathroom? Oh. Uh, well, I think this is that. It's quite a nice house, actually. It's a very big living room. Downstairs bathroom, no. Oh, there we are. The anatomy of the house is such that this analogy is less superficial than at first it may seem. To carry it further, if we were to dissect a house as we might a human cadaver, we would find ourselves okay. able to isolate and describe its various appendages and their functions in a decidedly anatomical fashion. There is even a fair number of direct comparisons to be drawn between those organs of the house and those of the human body. The organs of the house? You, uh, we may be talking about different houses, I, I don't know. We can sort of say, I think this is the garage. Oh. There you are. Can I... Do I have to... Ah! I crouch with the C button. This is a very unsettling space to be uh, navigating. Kitty Horror Show has done a really good job at like taking the sort of suburban and making it. For example, let us examine the uncanny. living room. Often the dominant space of a house is ground level, as well as typically the center of activity in a well populated home. The living room is very much the heart of the house. While a human heart circulates blood to oxygenate the body's extremities, the living room circulates people, activity, communication. It is the room most likely to be found beating, as active and vivacious as its name would imply. Mm. The comparison is only strengthened when we consider also that the living room is most commonly the room to contain the fireplace, making it additionally a locus of actual physical heat. Okay. No. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know what, okay. I'll go with it. I'll go with it. Well, I've been to the living room. I didn't see a tape. Oh, there it is. Definitely wasn't here before. and dining room as the stomach or digestive system of a house, though this comparison is tenuous. By contrast, the function and analog of a bathroom should be immediately obvious. The hallways and corridors of a house are its veins, providing circulation coursing throughout its frame. A staircase bears more than a passing resemblance, both physically and symbolically, to a spine. The windows of a house serve much the same purpose as eyes, and anyone who has ever rounded a bend or a long drive and come suddenly face to face with a tall, dark manor will tell you that it is difficult to shake the impression that the house, through its lightless windows, is a creature capable of vision and intelligence. Mm. 
There's a tape on the stairs. Yes. There it is. I will grant you. Houses do be looking sometimes. It's a spooky time. The bedroom is perhaps the room that most eludes direct comparison in this fashion. At a stretch, and allowing for a bit of poetic sympathy, it might be said that the bedroom is not unlike the human mind, or those parts of it which dictate thought and imagination. In the bedroom, dreams are dreamt, passions are ignited, epiphanies are experienced in cold sweat at early hours. In the bedroom is where people invariably spend the majority of their time, though comparatively little of it whilst conscious. Don't like that indefinite article. Alright, let's hunt, let's find, let's go through a few bedrooms, see what we can find. Okay, this is a new area. Nope. Ooh, that's a bug. That's another bug. Too many bugs, if you ask me. Is that? Oh, lovely! Some sort of bug appendage. Yeah. Okay. Oh, look. Oh. Can't see much in here. What? A... Somebody asleep? Is that? Over here. Just a chest of drawers. Just a chest of drawers. Okay. Just there. Did the layout of the hallways upstairs actually make sense? Yeah, maybe. <clears throat> and yet, this analogy is an incomplete one, for obviously the mind is an exceedingly complex thing. If the bedroom represents the thinking, dreaming part of the brain, then it is the basement that represents those lower, unconscious parts. The basement is dark. It is buried. It is a place full of cobwebs where memories are stored. A poignant comparison, truly. Often the unnerving uncertainty that comes with considering the deeper aspects of the human psyche is not unlike gazing down at the swimming blackness pooled at the bottom of a basement stairwell. It is a place we spend our childhoods filling with monsters that will lay for years in patient silence. It is a place that, barring some specific errand, we seldom ever want to go. Good! Right. Okay, well, before that, I'm going to read a couple of uh, Kofi's. Um, Kofi from Beans the Clown. Thank you for the wonderful stream. It helps pass the time while doing data entry stuff. Also, just got a copy of Family Business that I'm excited to dig in. Excited to dig into. More good news, going to a horror amusement park this weekend. Uh, so going to pretend to be brave, hiding behind friends, lol. Yeah, that's lovely. Um, uh, oh, uh, content note for uh, mention of abuse. Uh, I'll give a thumbs up when it's passed. But it's, uh, so, Beck has crisis. My good news is that my partner moved out of their abusive home, and I'm going to see her in about half an hour. I'm so excited since it's been a couple of months since I saw him last, and they're doing better emotionally since getting out. That's really good news. Um, very glad to hear it. Uh, and, yeah, uh, I hope they're doing well. Uh, Kofi from MLU. Good evening. That was a good jump scare. Also, please check the video. It's not showing quite right. Yeah, I think that's, that, I think that's back from when it's... <clears throat> Uh, oh, I might want to update the Steam game tag to Anatomy. Uh, yes, all right, all right. Ugh. Nag, nag, nag. That's mods for you, isn't it? Anatomy. 
stream info successfully updated. at. Okay. Right. On we go. I think the basement's through. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay, it's just... It's really... Oh. Okay, that's... I mean, I know it's just fiberglass. Not, you know, actual flesh. But, in my defence, fiberglass is still very bad for you. This... Okay, this feels... Okay, no jump scares. Just gonna follow the wall back. Back to the stairs. Okay, okay, we're at the stairs. Up, 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 up. I feel like they were shorter going down. Okay, we're good. We're good. Of course, this comparison, though appropriate, is a very heavy handed one. And often the basement is little more than a storage space, littered with the corpses of spiders and whip. Yeah, okay. While poets and psychoanalysts no doubt dread the thought of a dark basement, in truth, it is the bedroom, the waking mind, that place of dreams, which is actually the most frightening of all. Great. Go. Ignore. Yep, there we are. It's very dark in here. Ooh. Uh, can't really see anything. There's a. Okay, there's a big dresser. A mirror that does not show me. Oh, is that the tape? Okay. Okay. Uh, 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 what is, what is this? What is this a picture of? Whatever it is, it's got teeth. Oh, yeah, no, those, those are more teeth. Okay, teeth. 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 Okay, there's a lot of, um, also, uh, okay, yeah, I don't, hold on, I might just, uh, might just, uh, right. Uh, I'm starting to notice the absence of the door that I came in by. In fact, it seems like where the door should be, there is instead a tape recorder on the wall. It is here, in the bedroom that we are at our most vulnerable. Each night we shut our senses to the world for hours at a time, trusting in the house to keep us safe until next we wake. In this state of extreme vulnerability, we will spend something like 20% of our lives. Anything might stand beside us, watch us, keep us company until dawn, and we would never perceive it. We can only pray that the house will not let such things carry on as we sleep. In this way, during these hours, the bedroom seems less like a mind and more like a mouth. For it is here that the house is most likely to betray us. It is here that we place ourselves most at the house's mercy and spend each night hoping that it will not bite down. That's not actually the end of the game. But the game does close itself there. The implication being that we have been eaten by the house.
Oh, we can go in this cupboard now. Can we return to the master bedroom? We can. It seems... Uh, yeah, you know what? This is... This is nicer. In fact, is it still the master bedroom? Yeah, it is still the master bedroom. Still... A dresser... Bed... There's... There's the door. And, uh... Okay, that's weird. Double door. Let's, uh... Okay, I've actually gotten lost. Oh, no, I know where we are. Ish. Okay, here we are. Here we are. Let's see what you got to say for yourself now, you damn house. In the psychology of the modern civilized human being, it is difficult to overstate the significance so of So it's the same thing, but Since as early as the a little bit. A little bit. The main structures that mankind has invented for itself. I'm afraid there are no options for subtitles in this game. I think the like the difficulty like I I like yeah it's um I think in the first in the like in the first go through I think you're absolutely right some subtitles would be very welcome in the future ones like the the difficulty audio processing is is i think part of the point but obviously everyone has different levels for that so i uh, my apologies but uh, i don't believe that there are any options yeah like this is this isn't actually words this is this is just bad robot noise Oh, hang on. That's not right. That's not right. Okay. Which, which doors are unlocked? You're yeah, not the front doors. Front doors are not unlocked. Uh, where was the dark tape last time? Was it in the? Was it in the living room? No. Okay. In here, maybe? Maybe I'll just stay in here. This feels safe. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Let's, let's try some of the bedrooms that we didn't get a chance to go in last time. So, not the master bedroom, because that's the one what eats me. At least what, what at me. Where are you? Oh! Yep. It's not... It's not what you want. It's not what you want your art to be doing, to be honest. Oh, what? What? Oh, 
So, for those of you with difficulty audio processing, this is a really distorted version of the Now I Lay Me Down to Sleep. I pray my lo the Lord my soul to keep. If I should die before I wake, I pray the Lord my soul to take. Uh, yeah. Mm. Oh, there's the tape. Good. Uh, okay, that's... I know what that is. Um, I don't want to know. Let us... Simply... Just simply depart. Helicopter noise? I think. Oh, okay, that's nice and clear. Oh, do I need to close the door? There it is. Oh. Mm, okay. Well, it stopped glitching now we've picked it up, so that's something. <laughs> Okay, so this is the bit where they, he was talking about the stomach and the kitchen. Going. Staircase is a spine. The windows the eyes. Well, anyone who has ever rounded a bend in a long drive and come suddenly face to face with a pale, dark manner will tell you that the hands of the creature capable of. Look where that got a bit more fucked up near the end. Is it. Do. Was. Are you gonna tell me where the next tape is? I think last time it was in the garage, but. I didn't even tell me where the next tape was. Okay. There's a washer dryer in here. Can't get out this way, maybe. Okay, so no tape here. Oh, it might be in the basement. Let's find out, I guess. Oh. Oh, the basement is locked. Oh, g good. What What fantastic news. What? Can I... Ah! Okay, I'll, I'm going I'm to stop doing that. That's, that's new. TV. Oh, hang on. I can turn the TV on. That's new. And I'm not certain I'm psyched about it. It's not in here. Okay, back to the bedrooms. Oh, 
Oh. Oh no, we're in the fucking master bedroom again. Am I able to leave this time? You gonna eat me? No! Not being that! Okay. Hello! Oh, we've got some raiders, it looks like. Um. Yeah, we're playing anatomy, which is weird, spooky type horror. This is the room that most eludes direct comparison in this fashion. This is the If you can't understand what's being said, that's that's kind of intentional. It's it's mainly vibes and creepiness. Describing a dream about about teeth and bugs. Good basement time. That was, I believe, a dream from the perspective of the house, uh, and the how the inside of the house was full of teeth, and then a man broke in and was breaking stuff, and so the house killed him. I don't know if I'm that man. I don't think so. I think he mentioned that the man was urinating in the hallway, and I haven't done that. So, can I see? Oh, okay. Let's try this again. Bye, guy. Thanks for uh, thanks for raiding. Yeah, I think we got eaten again. See how this one goes. Oh, wonderful. Oh, this is new. This isn't where we normally start. Okay, um... It's all a bit strange. Oh, good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What is that? You never came back. Good. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 
Says bathroom next. Don't like these weird spider leg nonsenses. Feels bad. I quite like actually, I quite like that. Oh! Ooh! 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 Nope. Okay, I'm turning you off. Nope. Okay, I can't turn it off. That's fine though. That's absolutely fine. Everything's okay. Oh wait, no, of course I can't get through there. The door seems to be in the floor. Let's try upstairs. That's where we came in. Try this bedroom. Or bathroom. Nope, just an empty room. Oh no! What is that? That's, uh. Mm hmm. No, that's just some horrible noise. it stopping? Can I stop it? I cannot stop it. It is just screaming. Oh. Nope. It's still screaming. You finished yet? Nope. Still screaming. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Uh, yeah. Still screaming. Ah. The tape. Oh. Good news. Love to have a good time in the old house on a Hallows of Eve. Mm. Is it time? Still not time. Okay. Okay. I... This is all. This is all getting a bit much. It's all. There's a lot. There's a lot. There's a lot of current saying. Okay. Okay. Next tape. That's. Oh. 
Yep. Basement time. Okay, fiberglass is not well. I mean, there's them weird spidery, spidery legs, spidery glitches, but the uh, so far normal, so far normal. Got a big basement. Okay, so. Looks like my tactic of just skirt around the edges uh, is not going to get to the bottom of this whole basement situation. So uh, I'm going to plunge into the darkness. Oh. Hmm. So what the, what it said was there should be a distinction drawn between a dissection and a vivisection. Uh, you have interfered at every point you have poked or prodded. Uh, and when a house is hungry and awake, every room is the mouth. I don't know what's... I don't know where I am. I'm in a, a forest. I'm, I'm on a road. Those weird veins. What about... Oh, it's like a building site. That's a good moon.
this is a it's an invisible wall. Is that one? I feel like I'm horribly lost. Well, what is what is that? Red and flashy. I don't know if I'm meant to be following these red lines or... Just kind of doing the old follow one wall around trick. I'll be honest, I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, this really does feel a bit like the old bin. Well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if there is a way I'm supposed to go. Am I maybe... Maybe I'm supposed to close the game and reopen it. I might try that. I'm going to try closing anatomy and reopening it. There we go. Well, I'm walking very slowly. Definitely a fleshy floor. I do feel like maybe I'm being digested by our house. What is this? It's a, oh, it's a tree. Colossal tree. 
yes, I should probably have uh, said uh, content warning for audio distortions and upsetting noises. I'm gonna maybe quit the game again and see how that see if that helps. See how it goes. Let's try it again. Oh, angry again. Oh, no, I'm back here. I am back here. So this does seem like where I'm meant to be. Oh, I can press shift to run! No idea where I'm meant to be running to, but... Uh... Oh, oh no, there's some liquid now. This is... It's a house. Can't jump high enough to get to the house. Oh, I found the door. like a back alley maybe I can't I can't change perspective I can't move oh it's a tape what happens to a house when it is left alone what happens to a house when it is left alone it becomes worn and aged it becomes worn and aged when it's paint peels when it's paint peels and its foundations begin to sink when its foundations begin to sink it goes for too long and lived in. It goes for too long and lived in. What does it think of? What does it think of? What does it dream? What does it dream? How does it regard those creatures who built it? How does it regard those Are creatures who built it? Are only to abandon it? But its usefulness no longer, no longer satisfies them. Oh, its usefulness no longer satisfies them. It may grow lonesome. They stare for long hours into the darkness, its own empty halls, and see shadows. They stare. And its head may jump as it thinks, here, here is someone again, I'm not alone. And each time it is wrong, and the hurt starts over. It may haunt itself, it may haunt itself. inventing ghosts to walk its floor. Making friends with its shadow puppets. Laughing and whispering to itself at the end of some quiet cul-de-sac. It may grow angry. Its basement may fill with churning acid like an empty stomach. And its gorge may rise as it asks itself through clenched teeth, What did I do wrong? It may grow bitter. It may grow hungry. So hungry and so bitter that its scruples dissolve and its doors unlock themselves. While a house may hunger, it cannot starve. And so, in fever and anger and loneliness, it may simply lie in wait. 
doors open. Shades drop. Hallways empty. Hungry. I think that is the actual end of the game. I don't believe that there are any more endings. I think if I close it and open it now, it will simply start or start the loop again. So that was Anatomy. It's uh, it's a bit of a, it's a trip. I haven't played it in years, so I'd forgotten quite a lot of that, but oh boy. It is it is an audio challenge if you are uh, if you have difficulty with audio processing or if you're sensitive to unpleasant noises because a lot of it pretty unpleasant noises. Uh, but oh boy. I had a good time. I had a spooky time. So, uh, thank you all for joining me. I'm just going to check if we got any final Kofis. Uh, but, uh, distorted screams to study slash relax to. Which is very much yes. Uh, Kofi from MLU. Now it's perfect! Thank you, MLU. I don't remember what that's in reference to, but brilliant. Uh, Kofi from Shea Topaz. Hello, and a happy spooky season. My good news of the day is that my Nautilus-shaped bag arrived today, as well as my copy of Eric Loroca's new novella, Just in Time for Halloween. Have a great day and a great Halloween. You too, and I hope you really enjoy the, uh, the book, and that sounds like a really cool bag. Love a Nautilus. Uh, so, thank you very much for joining me on this halloween e -ne 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 uh, for a pair of short, bite-sized, but very sinister games. Uh, I've had a really good time. I've had a really spooky time. And we are going to raid uh, our good friend, Finn the Bin. Uh, Finn, she is playing uh, Fallout New Vegas, as is her want. Um, and uh, I think our raid phrase will be, uh, Do something spooky! Just in the hopes of... Uh, just in the hopes of just prodding her into doing something spooky. So, thank you once again, uh, everyone, for joining me. Uh, thank you very much, Jester and Maddie, for modding. Uh, I think normal streams should be uh, going on uh, this Sunday. Oh, there's the um, uh, Magnus Archives 2 sort of launch live stream. Uh, on Sunday, uh, I'm going to be there between, I want to say 6 and 8, maybe 5, maybe, I might be there from the start, 5.30, I'd need to check the schedule. Uh, I'm finishing at 8 because, well, I'm finishing at 7.30 because at 8, uh, MacGuffin and Company, we are we are still doing our stream uh, as normal. Uh, we're going to be playing some Pit Crawler, um, you know, which uh, it does kind of clash with the end of the TMA2 stream, but, you know, they scheduled those, and we've got to pay our mods, so, uh, we are, uh, we are streaming as normal, so, uh, hopefully see you on Sunday, uh, and until then, thank you for joining me, and, uh, as we say at the end of every scream, that, that wasn't even intentional, ha! As we say at the end of every scream, Bye.